Oh, you, you said it so quiet, like. Well, I was going to say it louder, but you started talking, so I shushed. Yeah. So it is our do-it-yourself week, and we're going to come back to this one triumphant. Woo. We're going to get through this. We're going to do it right, and it's going to be awesome. <laughs> very least it'll be okay so it's tasty all right well you know instead of looking at the instructions in Japanese I'm gonna open the package and then Dana will let us know what we have to do so we have these are our molds this, oh goodness, this is just soft candy. soft candy. Oh, is there anything else in there? There's sticks! Okay, so we have everything. There's a silver package, a white package, sticks, and a mold. So these come apart. So. It says, using the picture on the back of the package as a reference, working on the small spaces first, fill one animal mold with a soft candy. Also fill in the same animal mold on the other tray. All right, so. Like so, and like so. Right. All right, I'm going to do the easy one first. Sure. So th I guess these are going to be two different colors. We've yes. got pink. Oh, look at the pink. And I'm guessing the other one's going to be yellow. And the other one is yellow. All right, so that, that's the hard one. Let's do the easy one first. <laughs> so <clears throat> let's see what we got. Uh, so the full body is yellow mm -hmm. and the ears are pink. So it says working with the small one first. We do uh, that. Yeah. And yeah. I think they mean the small space. Yeah, the small space is on the other one as well. Achoo! Kazoom tight. Oh, good lord. <laughs> it sticks to fingers. But not to the... <laughs> Oh, this is going to be a thing of beauty. <laughs> We're coming back triumphant, you said, right? Shut up. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is awful. I love you. No, you don't. I do. Uh. What, do I have to grease? Does it say anything about greasing your hands first? No, it says nothing about greasing your hands. Because this is literally just not... It's sticking to my finger. Look, that's as best as I can do. Because every time I try to do it better... Oh! Wow. Are you... Oh. How does it taste? Mmm. -hmm. Tastes like candy. I have a better idea. Oh. <laughs> You're kidding me. You're kidding me. Um. <coughs> yeah, laugh it up, Chuckles. I will. All right. Well, this... Oh, my God. Are you kidding me? This one's going to be all yellow. And what we'll do is we'll do a row of pink 
in the other one. I think they mean the other one, like the other mold part. Just because if you look at the picture, so you put some of that in there, and then when that flips over, that stuff's going to be on the top. So I can't do them both at the same time? Well, I mean, I suppose if you want to, yes. Maybe, maybe, maybe. I like how you say that. I'm, I'm going to take it off camera for a second because it's really hard to see so, through the viewfinder. Yeah, while you do that. Yeah, entertain the masses. So, yeah, this is what we're supposed to have. So, this is what we're currently doing. This is what we're supposed to end up with. I'm pretty sure that's not what we're going to end up with. But, we're trying. <laughs> he is working diligently, folks. This isn't easy. No, not at all. I don't understand why it sticks so much. I don't know. I blame the candy. Well, yeah. I mean, it's 100% the candy's fault. Yes. For being so darn sugary. <laughs> and not as sticky as it maybe should have been? No, no, it's very sticky. Well, yeah, the, but it's not sticking to the right thing. Yeah, the case isn't sticky. I'm supposed to use no. I'm just supposed to use the sticks to uh, to to hold them. Yeah, that's the third part. A few moments later. This is kind of stupid. I have faith that you can do this. <laughs> At least semi competently. Oh come on! Just go in there. Not there. Oh. The more manipulated, the worse it gets. Triumphantly, folks. This is what we're doing. I... I did not expect this to be this hard. I will not lie. It's all because everything is just sticking to my fingers for no fucking reason. What? Did you meow? Oh, uh, I don't know. Oh, and I just dropped some. Oh, oh my god. I can get the stuff you dropped. <laughs> just so that my cat doesn't eat it. A few moments later. <laughs> Magic! Okay. Urgh. <clears throat> so, uh, once completed, put one tray over the other, snapping the face shut. That's what I'm doing. <laughs> right now. <laughs> magic! Manly magic. Little force never hurt anyone. Nope. Well, I don't know. Little force never hurt anyone. All right. Okay. So while holding down on the tray, insert one stick between the between the trays to make the soft candy lollipop. Open the sticks, please. I will try. Thanks. You should have. Yeah, have one of those. Come on, open up. Open. Yeah. Alright, I give you a stick. Or sticks. Hello, uh, Come here, my baby. Uh, oh, yeah. And now the reveal. Oh. That didn't look too bad. That's actually not too look. bad. Look. That's actually kind of Take off the excess. It's kind of a cute little bear thing. That that's a giraffe, honey. It looked like a bear. I'm that's sorry. that's the, a giraffe. The back. It was harder to see. Here, take <gasps> the giraffe. Yeah, get the giraffe. Like. And the bear. Oh, I see. He's he's um a calico bear. Yeah, that's a real thing. Yeah, of course it is. All right. No, no. Oh, you dropped it, you idiot. I'm a giraffe. You're an idiot. Why do you even do? Hello. Go away. But, uh, uh, 
Mm, it's my show. No, I need the time spotlight. Ah. <laughs> okay, we're done. <laughs> All right, you can eat it. I suppose so. Bye, giraffe. Um. Mm, very candy like. Um. Magnificent. Mm hmm. Oh. Okay, I got here. So it's my little bear. And bear is gonna be how? Gone. <laughs> Gone. Yeah, it's a little fruity, very fruity. Yeah. So it was good. Just not the simplest thing to make. That no. You, like you might expect. No. Everything stuck to my fingers. Yeah. And nothing stuck to the mold. So it was incredibly frustrating to do. And I hated every minute of it. Mm -hmm. I think we're going to give up on the do-it-yourself. Oh. Well, we've only got a few more to try. You never oh. know. Oh, I know. I know. But we, we, at least we did one. So that's good. Mm -hmm. And that was very triumphant. Our triumphant return. It actually happened. We'll do the moose for the last episode. Okay, sure. All right. So we'll be back in a moment to eat this stuff. Woo. Don't forget that. <laughs> and uh, we'll see you in a second. Hey. We're back. We are back. It's true. 100% true. And we have this, 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 and this. So, without further ado, let's try this because it's grape and Dana hate it. Let's try this because it's grape and Dana will hate it. That's right. Great. Great is gross. Great is not gross. It is. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. No. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Oh, it smells really good. Like, it smells super gravy. Oh, wow, does it ever want? So what? And I've got a little bunny rabbit. Um. See, bunny, 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 bunny. I am. And this is. I don't know what this is. This is a giraffe. What What do you got? I don't know. What is that? That That is a giraffe. Okay. See, she had it upside down. But you oh. see, there's the face and the spots and the little legs at the bottom. Okay. Ow! Um. You're already making faces. It was great. Mm. It's gummy, though, so I mean. I like that. So, a little harder gummy, but... Yeah, but it's okay. Mm-hmm. So, animal land gummy. Great. That's it. Yeah, Goodbye. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, done. Uh, so, enjoy these cute and tasty animal-shaped gummy. I did. Each bag contains one gummy that is bigger in size than the rest. How many different, different animals did you find in the bag? And he goes searching now. Oh, I see the big one. So we had two giraffes and another thing. Okay, so this is another giraffe. Okay, so that's... And that... Oh, it's a hippo. Hard to tell, but it's got its really mouth open. Yeah. Uh, that looks like sheep. a sheep. If you beep, click on it, beep. it will explode. Beep, beep, sheep, what? I don't know if it's supposed to be a... Oh, it's a squirrel. squirrel. Yeah, it's a squirrel. Uh, you're not going to really see the detail in that. But. Unfortunately, the details don't come through so... Much. And there's not really one that's bigger than the rest, unless we already ate it. Maybe. Lion. Rar. Meow. Simba. All of this will be yours, if the price is right. I don't think that was the part of it. And another bunny. Bunny. We were lied to. There was no bigger one. Oh, yeah. And, that's, and you see it even in the bag, it says, oh, might there be a bigger one? There's supposed to be one bigger one. Wasn't this the one that you thought were penguins? Yes, I thought it was a penguin. Yeah, no penguins. It's a penguin doing this kind no of thing. Penguins. Oh, I didn't say also, No penguins. Also, no bigger one. No. Oh. On to the next thing. Ooh. Let's look at these. They are chocolates wrapped in pink nits, wrapped in. <clears throat> pink nits? Well, yeah, wrapped in leaves. Because, every, because everyone loves a little pink leaf in their life. They come individually wrapped. Yay. And there's even a white 
uh, ghost guy on him. I, I mean, he's cute, but he's a little creepy. You seem a little bit on the back. Wait, hey, Hocus. He... No? And he's on the front going, hey, folks. <laughs> he's going on the front going, hey, what you're about to eat may or may not be disgusting. <laughs> well, it, it's, it's very chocolatey at first glance. Yes. Oh, it looks ooh. chocolatey and strawberry. It does. You know, it's with fits with. Oh, it's it's like the um, we've had something similar to this in the February one. I don't like the smell of it. Gonna, I won't lie; I'm... it reminds me of Play-Doh. Hmm. Hmm. Got me in a shop. Hmm. I'm not sure, but it's not bad. So, that taste is reminding me of Play-Doh. You're right. And the gummy, I think, is like Turkish delight. Oh, that's possible, yeah. That's what it reminds me of. I'm just going to cleanse my palate. <laughs> so, um, they are Tiro Choco Sakura Mochi. Sakura mochi is traditional Japanese snack that consists of pretty pink colored rice cake with a sweet red bean paste center. Not Turkish delight. <laughs> nope. That's wrapped in a pickled cherry blossom leaf. With the trio choco, you can now imagine what the real thing tastes like. Unpleasant. It probably tastes a little bit different. I didn't much care for that. I thought they were okay. The, the Play-Doh taste, though, was... It, it was a little weird. Yeah. Not bad, but weird. Dars. <gasps> More chocolate. Or, or Dar. Maybe it's a silent S. From our good friends at Creepy Spider Lady. Maybe not, though. It uh, comes in another package. Ooh, wonder if it comes in another package, another package. Oh, and they're individually <laughs> wrapped. No. <laughs> no. But, but it does come in a tray. Yeah. Uh, if you can get the tray out. There we go. Ta -da -da! Blah. Tray. Tray Jolie. <laughs> Very nice. Take it, Darce. I, I will. Or Dar. Dar. <laughs> Sindar. Well, it, it smells very chocolatey and slightly. Um, it has that Play Doh. Matcha. It has that Play Doh smell to me. Not me. It's green in the middle, so uh, matcha. Really strong matcha, though. Yeah. Like, I'm not accustomed to that. <laughs> hmm. Yeah, actually really, really strong. It's not bad. No. Mm. The chocolate really balances it, so it's not like you're overpowered by matcha. Not like Play-Doh candy. <laughs> so, this is Dar's Uji Matcha Flavor. So, Dar's Chocolate is one of the most popular chocolate franchises in Japan. This series brought to you by Morinaga can be commonly found in most any convenience stores across the country. This time, Dar's releases a limited edition green tea flavor that has slightly bitter green tea center to offset the rich and sweet chocolate coating. <laughs> Well, that's why it tastes as strong, I guess, because yeah. it's bitter green tea instead of not bitter green tea, I guess. So the last thing we have is a ring pop. Now, Dana can't have any because she's sick. Yeah, I'm going to sick. And she says it's probably grape anyway. Oh, it looks maybe grape. Uh, it looks, or orange well, color. I don't know. It, it looks cola flavored by the package. I remember that from... Right, yeah. See, cola. Cola. And it's brown, orange so brown, yeah. orange. Well, yeah. yeah, brown is part of the orange spectrum, but that's okay. Um, tastes like fake cola. <laughs> mm. All right, so this is as far as I can get it on my finger. Aww. So it's cola diamond ring. Mm. As the saying goes, diamonds are a girl's best friend. 
This time we bring you the cute edible type that can also be worn. Enjoy the fun diamond-shaped cola-flavored ring by showing off the rock to your friends. Oh, look what Dana gave me today. Isn't it divine? Ow. Ow. <laughs> yeah. No, it's cool. <coughs> um. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Ow, it really hurt my way out. <laughs> what would you expect? Mm. I will sweeten the pain away. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm done with that. It's one of those rings that you can... Like ring pop. It's a ring pop. Yeah. It's exactly what it is. It's a ring pop. Yeah. And that's all we have for today. So a couple of chocolate things, gummy thing, and um, the ring and the, the do-it-yourself. Which was fabulously done. I kind of liked it. And he drops it. Because he doesn't like it. Which, yeah. Stop it! You're making a mess! Oh. Just, just, just... Okay. In the mouth. No! <laughs> I'll eat them, but I'm not gonna eat them right now. I have one right now. So you said you didn't like them. No, you said you have one right now. Okay, what? I didn't nom, say... Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> um... Bye. <laughs>